On June 4, 1989, a pro-democracy protest in Tiananmen Square, Beijing, was violently suppressed by the Chinese government. The protest was led by students and intellectuals who were calling for greater political freedom and an end to corruption in the Chinese government. The protest began in April of that year and quickly grew in size, with thousands of students and citizens joining in. The Chinese government initially allowed the protest to continue, but as it continued to grow, they became increasingly concerned and began to take steps to quell it. On June 3 and 4, the Chinese government declared martial law and deployed troops and tanks to the streets of Beijing. On the morning of June 4, the military moved into Tiananmen Square and began to forcefully clear the protesters from the area. The exact number of casualties is not known, but it is estimated that hundreds, possibly thousands of people were killed or injured during the crackdown. The Chinese government's response to the protest was widely condemned by the international community, and the events of June 4 are still a sensitive topic in China today. The Chinese government has never released an official death toll and has suppressed any discussion or commemoration of the event. The event is still considered a taboo topic and not allowed to be discussed in China, and many Chinese people do not know about it. The Tiananmen Square protest and its violent suppression remain one of the most significant events in modern Chinese history and continue to be a source of tension between China and the international community.